it's time. Finally, planned for a long time, postponed a couple for a couple of weeks, but now I'm leaving on the way to the airport. Good morning from Fort Lauderdale. I slept the first night in the car, which was actually just a couple hours, but kind of terrible. Super hot here. I had to start the car a couple of times to cool it down with the air condition. It, there's no way, I'm just sweating all the way. And, uh, and there are a million no CM flies here, so uh, it's not really like I imagined it would be. I have to work on that definitely. <laughs> but for now, I'm here, I'm awake, I'm kind of rested and now I'm going to explore the city and drive that beast. update on my road trip so far. So I cruised around for a lot of day today, did a little shopping, bought some fruit and stuff. Actually I went to uh, a German supermarket called Aldi. Very good, super cheap. And yeah, had a couple of swims on the beach and really like the water. It's super warm. It's actually hot. And uh, yeah, now I'm going to catch up with some friends and tomorrow I'm driving to Miami. Aloha. Good morning. I'm sitting here on South Beach, Miami. I think one of the most famous beaches in the whole US. It's uh, just a little past sunrise, so not too many people here. But I decided I'm driving to Key West today. I slept another night in the car, which was the same like yesterday, just a little longer. Um, way too hot. It's, I'm, I wake up completely sweated and then I have all these little no seams and mosquitoes in there. I can't open the roof. I got to figure out to do it better. Um, I don't want to get bit like hell from the mosquitoes and I don't want to sweat like hell and sleep and sleep so bad. So, yep, road trip number two, day number two. Um, need to learn how to sleep better.
Northwest, I'm coming. It's a few more miles. What a beautiful day, what a beautiful ride. Unbelievable. I'm absolutely toasted. Here I am, Key West, and I definitely need a swim. I want to stop a few times in between, but you know, if you're doing 50 or 60 miles on the highway and you see something, too late. But now I'm going to swim. Definitely. I'm melting. The water is so warm, it's not even refreshing at all. Unbelievable. Must have been around, whatever, 32 degrees Celsius. Oh wow, what is that? That looks awesome. Free admission, but shirts and shoes required. And I have neither shirt nor shoes. So, where's my car? Let's try again. That was the southernmost part of the continental US, which is twice a lie. First is, it's not continental US. They are islands. Even they're connected by bridges, they are still islands. And the second is, it's not the southernmost point. That's probably here where the naval base is, but nobody's allowed to go there, so that's the reason why they put this pylone over there. Whatever, it works. Summer is gone But the summer is gone But the summer is gone but This is where Ernest Hemingway drank most of his liquor. <laughs> Oh
it is a nice place here. Um, it's of course totally touristy, but there are some really nice corners. There's some nice architecture here as well. When you um, leave Dual Street, there are some really nice houses and good old wooden structures, so very nice. But mostly it's about the tourists here and, and there's so many boats out there driving out the tourists every day, which is nothing for me, especially. Uh, it's very pricey. There is a lot of money here or people spend a lot of money here and even, even if you just buy a hot dog, it's seven dollars. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Yep, I enjoyed my time here, even if it was just a small stopover. Um, and now I'm heading back north for the next adventure. This is the Everglades. I want to drive one of these airboats. Good morning from Miami. So I give you a little update. I'm still cruising around Florida and I've been to Key West yesterday and the day before. It was a really nice drive down there, the US one. And now I'm back in Miami. So after sleeping a couple of nights in the car, which is not really comfortable, I decided to take a hostel. So here in Miami, I, I've been to Jazz at the hostel in South Beach. It's uh, cheap, just uh, cost me $16 for a night in a 12 dorm, which is okay. I just needed a you know, place to stretch my legs. But now I'm up again. It's early in the morning, it's 7 a.m. and now I'm going to the Everglades and looking for an alligator. I stopped here in the Everglades National Park. It's, I think it's uh, Shark Valley. Just to read the sign and I think I'm never leaving the car. Look at this. I mean, this is <laughs> just, there are a million, a million mosquitoes around me already and I just stopped here for a minute. I will die the minute I leave the car. I will have a couple hundred mosquito bites. So I'm not leaving. <laughs> Oh, that was quite some fun. Drove around there. I would get lost within a minute, but our captain pretty much knew where he was driving around and yeah. Next stop, Fort Myers or maybe Naples. Don't know, just driving along the coast.
I kept on driving up the coast, cruised through Naples, Fort Myers, all the way up to Tampa. I met a couple friends over there, so the good thing is I didn't have to sleep in the car anymore. I was actually provided some very comfortable beds. Had a couple of drinks with them and slowly made my way up to Tampa where I gave back the car, jumped into a plane and flew back home. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little trip. See you next time. Aloha. Listen to the music. I'm sitting here in Florida in a nice, it's actually a villa, I guess. Yeah, at a friend's place. And I have to listen to this music. Typical Bavarian shit.